Ready? Right. Okay. Right. Good. Yep. Okay. Um, you know, really uh, difficult to even put into words because it's been a long time since we've had a game like that. Uh, we were beaten in every area, um, and uh, no ifs, ands, or buts. They just uh, kicked, kicked uh, the tail out of us from the beginning to the end. They controlled the football. They were physical. Uh, they got aggravating rush yards, uh, got first downs, possessed the football. Did just you know just constantly held on to the ball. Uh, offensively, we had way too many three and outs. 32, 36 plays to, to 92, um, you know, you don't have a chance to win a game when it's like that. Um, so, you know, it's, it's, again, it's one of those years that uh, our players and I got to do a better job of getting them, getting them ready. And um, I felt it, um, you know, but, uh, you know, it's going to be hard and an emotional year. It's physically and mentally taxing on everybody. And uh, you, you, we have to respond better than this. Um, you know, going, you know, I thought we were prepared to go on the road back to back and uh, play well. And uh, we, we certainly didn't do that. Give, give them credit. I thought uh, um, Eli really had uh, their team ready to play. They were tired of hearing about uh, losing to us. And as I said earlier in the week, uh, didn't, didn't mean anything. Uh, you know, previous years, it's about this year. And they were certainly ready to play and we weren't. So definitely want to give them credit. Josh. Mark, what was the thinking there to put Joey in at the end? Was it just to get reps? You think what's your plan next week going into Georgia? Not sure. John Hale. Mark, I, I, I know you don't probably have a lot of details, but can you share anything with us about what Coach Slarman's status is and him not making the trip today? Um I just want to confirm, you know, obviously he was not able to make it. And, um, you know, I want to respect Leanne and John and their family and, and their privacy. And, um, you know, I don't think uh, it's right for me to comment anymore about that. Derek. Mark, after the defense got the stop on the 21 play drive, uh, the running backs didn't get a touch on that three and out. I was just wondering if you could explain kind of the thought process there a little bit. Yeah, not not very good. I mean, we, you know, we, uh, you know, not a very good series. Um, so, Larry. Mark, do you think John not being with you? Had any emotional impact on your your guys one way or the other today? Uh, I'm sure it did, but it is you know the the situation. We have to be able, um, you know, to to respond, and um, you know that's a tough question because uh, I don't want to put anything on John. I mean, John's given us, my lord, he gives us so much more than than any normal human being can. Um, you know, so yes, we missed them, but that's not an excuse. We need to respond and play great for him and uh, in honor of him. And uh, we didn't do that today. John Clay. Uh, Mark, you, you said you, you know, you thought you had your team ready to play back to back road games, but did you get a feeling before the game or in warm ups that maybe they were a little flat or, or, or not? I did because I knew that this team was going to be ready to go. They were tired of hearing about losing to us, however many games in a row. And uh, they had a week off and um, had time. They knew, you know, uh, last Friday they were playing us, so had, had a couple of extra days to prepare. And, you know, they, they did a good job. They, they, he had them ready to play, and that's the bottom line. And, uh, you know, I didn't. You know, we didn't respond. Uh, they did. And, they, they beat the tar out of us, and, uh, you know, we've got to respond. Josh? Mark, what more do you think your defense could have done today going out? I mean, just being out there for as many snaps as they had to be out there. We needed to, we needed to get off the field. We let them mush us too long. Um, yes, that, that's 
uh, you know, partly, you know, offensively when you're not getting first downs, it, it hurts your, de your defense. But, you know, that was only part of it today. We gave up way too many yards. Um, you know, we were getting mushed. We were getting pushed around from the beginning of the game. Um, even though they weren't putting up a lot of points, they were controlling the game. And uh, that's, you know, normally what, what we like to do. You know, if we could physically uh, run the ball and, and get first downs and, and play good defense, and they did that today. And, uh, you know, they, they beat us at our own game, and they, they did it decisively. John Hale. Mark, I know you mentioned you talked about that one drive after the long uh, Missouri drive where you didn't run the ball any. But in general, do you feel like you all tried to establish the run enough? I mean, it seemed like AJ and Chris both had success, and they just don't have many carries overall when you look at the box score. No, I think you're correct, and I think um, you know that's part of that is is definitely a fair criticism, and we're going to look back and uh, and. It was almost too, or it was later in the game when we went to some sets and started cutting it off because they had a good plan for when we when we weren't securing the edges with with taking the dive and making the quarterback pull it. There were a couple missed reads early where he maybe could have pulled it, but they had a nice plan. And um, then we got to the bigger sets in twelve, and we had some success. That's when we drove down and scored. Then we came back and uh, tried it again, and they shut it down. And then, and then you know, we, we had incomplete and incomplete. So, um, you know, we went back to that set. Uh, I think it was still a seven-point game. And uh, we're not able to move it. Um, you know, so they, they uh, you know, got, got it ironed out. Right. On that possession you're talking about there, when AJ was back in, was Chris available then or was it just AJ? You know, don't, don't quote me on that. I get mixed up, you know what I'm saying, on exactly right. who and what possession we're talking about and all that. But, uh, but um, yes, I believe Chris was available, yes. All right, got time for two more. Max Baker. Coach, um, when you were preparing for Missouri this week, and you know you probably watched, you know, all three of their games, but especially LSU where they passed the ball so much, were you sort of expecting the game plan that Drinkwitz had, where you, you know, they ran the ball I think fifty something times? Yeah, he he always wants to be balanced. Um, he does a nice job, you know, through the years of being uh, always having um, efficient rush yards, and it was working for him when. Um, you know, when you're just getting, you know, four yards or five yards and, and constantly getting positive yardage and mushing us like that, um, it's aggravating on the defense. And uh, they were in control, and um, that was uh, that was aggravating for us. Uh, we've got to do a better job and, and, uh, and, you know, be more stern in there and get them in predictable situations. They had us off balance all day. We'll wrap up, Coach, with Larry Vaughn. Mark, it seemed like your defense also had more trouble tackling or maybe being in position to tackle today than what they normally have. Was that more a credit to Missouri or just poor execution on your part? It's, it's, uh, I'm sure when we look at the film, it'll be a little bit of both. Um, you know, I think they do a nice job the way they get in certain sets and the way they're uh, spilling the ball to the perimeter um, puts a little pressure on us. And um, I know – you know, there was a lot of aggravating yards and lost leverage a little bit. And, and then at times we felt like they had, le you know, we had leverage and they hit it up inside. So it's a little bit of everything, um, but certainly you have to credit them. And, um, you know, and, and, uh, and Larry Roundtree has been around for a long time and uh, he's a really, really good runner. And I uh, thought they had a good plan. So, um, you know, you got to give a lot of credit to them and, Certainly, we want to do some things better. All right, thanks, guys. We'll have players here in just a few Thank minutes. You.